come see you, man. You're trying to work out the whole program. So for Tommy G, is that, you got like a two-year plan, a one-year plan? Like where do you see yourself in, in this whole you know, music business right now? It's because it's changing so rapidly from, I mean, before when we were selling CDs and units were the, the big thing, but now you're just moving. It's all about the downloads. It's all about the downloads in this business, you know what I mean? You can't, you can't just jump out there and drop a single and everybody be like, yeah, yeah, expect everything to be to be jumping at you. You gotta get out there and promote your single, you know what I mean? So unless the whole situation is right, it don't, need, it don't make no sense. Signing to anybody doesn't make no sense dropping a single. You know what I mean? You gotta make sure the hype is behind you and it's building behind you. A lot of hate gonna come with it, you know, I got it, but it ain't nothing, you know what I'm saying? Just keep going, keep moving forward. Nothing yeah, will really stop you. Definitely, man. I love the positive vibes that you're moving with. Now, mm -hmm. this is just, uh, now it's just you yourself that's an artist putting out music. Now, do you have a team, like a production team? You work with other artists? Um, I work with, we got like, what is this, Cut Again? We got uh, maybe like 12 artists. We all work together. We all produce each other's music. You know what I mean? We work with each other in the studio so we have a positive vibe and fresh ideas coming to the plate. Uh, I'm mostly going to work with a couple of producers. You know what I mean? I work with Leo Tempest. I got the Anime Boys, I work with uh, Jay Scissorhands, and uh, I got a couple of records produced by T. Williams. You know what I mean? Definitely, man. So it sounds like you have a strong camp that you specifically work with. Are you looking to work with other artists? And if so, you know what I mean, how can they get at you? I'm, I'm always open to work with other artists, you know what I mean? It's not hard to find me, you know what I mean? You got my website, TommyGLine.com, SoulRightsMD.com, it looks up on MySpace, Twitter, Facebook. I'm always open, you know, it's just dudes got to reach out. Don't be scared, you know what I mean? We all got to work with each other for, for the stuff to happen, and for the whole situation to go bigger than it is. You know what I mean? That's right, man. So you're hearing up here first, man. Tommy G is down to work for everybody. He's on every search, social network that you just mentioned right there, man. <laughs> he seems like he's everywhere right now on the streets. Now, real quick, if you can talk about the single that we're going to throw to real quick, what the name of this track is. This record is called Hold You. Yeah, I done had this record sitting in December, sitting by artists since like uh, December. You know what I mean? Like I said, the situation gotta be right before it comes out, right? It's produced by T. Williams. Um, it's a crazy record, goes by the name of T. Minus right now. You know what I mean? I sing, and I rap on the record. You know what I mean? So he's double threat right there, man. Double. I write my own music, so. Triple threat. Mm -hmm. He wants all the money, man. He's trying to get all the <laughs> points off the publishing. Definitely, man. Yeah. I love that. So we're going to throw that joint real quick right now. I want to thank you for coming through. Yeah, you going to pick up anybody real quick, anybody that you uh, can. Shout out Soul Vibes, whole Cardi Gang crew, Black City, all my fam. You know who we is. You know who we do. We do a kiss, baby. All right, man. Definitely. Sound Junction 105.5. We're doing it big all the way to 12 o'clock, man. The Cinderella Hour. Right now, we got Hold You On Deck by Tommy G. Turn your radios up, turn your internet speakers up, plug in the basement, let's go, man. That's how we do it. Sounds of 105.5.